on my work or ass so up, trying to get to it. Massage your feet. This nigga be waking me up all the time, bro. Shut the fuck up, bro. This nigga flipping his party clothes. Hey, yeah. Massage, nigga. Fuck. See it, man. It's like 6.15, something like that, 6 o'clock. But, um, yeah, man. Early as a motherfucker. I'm just getting a massage right now, though. Yeah, I like to wake up pretty early, you know what I'm saying? At least before everybody else do it, just so I can <laughs> meditate, you know what I'm saying? And get everything organized up top in the mind. Because it's Monday, dog. Wee. If you don't start your day off right, that Monday come. Beat your ass, <laughs> see what I'm saying, so. Yeah, I got my own food spot. I got pieces. Yeah, boy. If you didn't know, now you know. Yeah, bro. Pepperoni. You meat eating ass niggas. Beefy. You know what I'm saying? And we deliver. Nigga, that's the hotline right there, bro. Five right here. Five. Boom, got what Fish, yeah. Yeah, 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 you ready, bro? Who my nigga at? Ciao. Hello. What's up, man? Oh. Niggas ain't, 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 how to get yourself out there in the outlandish, outlandish world. We know what it is, man. We got people like Lil Nas X, he getting his own day. And we already know how all the wild shit he's doing out here just to get attention. And I, at times, I know young creators out here and content creators and um, just artists in general, entrepreneurs, you know, you might be thinking like, damn, is that what I gotta compete with? That shit, I mean. <laughs> If you have to. I mean, it's on you. But nonetheless, man, for me, what, what what works for me, bro, is the fact that I know my lane, dog. Like, even with the NBA show, that's basketball. I've been playing basketball plug, my whole plug, entire life. Plug. I, know the ins, I know the ins and outs of basketball. Goddamn, there are 500,000 um, 500, subscribers over there. But nonetheless, um, I've learned how to take all of my endeavors and, and kind of just make them a, a cohesive unit. You know what I'm saying? I know that basketball, music, and all of these, you know, that's, that's my lane. You know what I'm saying? So for me... I learned how to, you know, just go where I fit in, bro. It's like, it, it doesn't really matter too much for me like that no more. All I know is if I got 500 people rocking with me, 500,000, I know they rock with what I do. And I don't have to necessarily go outside of who I am in order to be able to get shit popping for myself. I'm in the crypto space, you know what I'm saying? Everybody know I'm a basketball player. I'm going to play music and this, that, and the other. But I've learned how to take different endeavors and, and bring it into my space and bring it into my world. It's a lot of athletes that need to know about the crypto space and how important it is to to tap into, you know, NFTs and stuff like that. You know, uh, I'm a brand ambassador for Soul Token, Blood. Death Free Token, um, Squeeze Token. And uh, I use my, my celebrity in order to draw more attention to uh, what they're doing on, on that side. So it's like I'm learning how to make everything one cohesive, cohesive unit. You dig what I'm saying? And, and, and work that way. But more importantly, bro, shit, for me, you got to stay in your lane and do what you do best and know exactly what you do great. And, uh, and and stick with that, and then you know you you, you innovate with the times, you dig, and then plug and play.